Burlington City Councilors can't agree to what to do with millions of dollars from the sale of Burlington Telecom. A trio of lawmakers urging their peers to vote to invest that money back into the company, now owned by Schur's Communications. NBC 5's Tom Garris is live outside of Burlington Telecom's office on Church Street to explain. Tom. Well, guys, uh, ahead of a big city council meeting next week, lawmakers are squaring off over how to spend some $5.3 million resulting from that sale of Burlington Telecom. Now, this afternoon, as you said, three city councilors spoke to reporters and are urging their peers to invest that money back into Burlington Telecom next week. That would get the city a chair on the company's board and let them share in future profits. The councilors that we're speaking today say if they invested all of that money, the city would see returns of hundreds of thousands of dollars each year down the line, allowing them to reduce property taxes. But not all lawmakers are on board. I spoke with two over the phone this afternoon who say they want to cash out that money and let the public weigh in on how to spend it. But the councilors who say to invest, though, say that Burlington Telecom is now a strong business and the city should see a piece of that profit. And what a shame it would be if after what the citizens of Burlington went through with this and the council went through and everybody went through, if when we hit a point where the company has turned around and is an incredible success story now and is poised to take off even more so, if the city council in a very short-sighted way pulls the plug on this, takes cashes out and leaves those future earnings for sures to reap instead of the residents and taxpayers of Burlington. I have real doubts about uh, having city government invest in a private company. I'm not in favor of taking um, additional risk to the city when we have so many other needs in the city um, that we could be using this money for. Now, Burlington Mayor Moreau Weinberger is proposing to invest about half of that money back into Burlington Telecom. And the councilors who are fighting to invest that money say they can live with that, a call to middle ground, let's say. But uh, those I spoke with who are on the other side say that they think the risk here is too big to want to invest at all. So we'll have to keep an eye on how this plays out next week. But for now, we're live in Burlington. Tom Garris, NBC5 News.